Hey Jeff, here's a self-made video of the crane for you. I left it like that. Alan Hyman here. I left it like that last night. I hooked on to a 15,000 pound capacity Wiggins forklift weighs 18, 19,000 pounds. I left the cables taut and believe it or not the boom's still fully up in the air and extended and has not creeped down any, I don't think at all. It's on dry concrete. You take a look at all the outriggers, they're still down and firm. There is no oil, no leaks, no drips, no puddles underneath of the crane. Let's see if we can't slowly walk around it and take a closer look at her. The cylinders are good. No oil, a little dirty in there, could use some housework, but there's no oil leaking out of it. Good rubber. Yeah, the outside tires are fair, the inside. Inside tires are much better. Let's go down here quickly, get you dizzy, and look at that. And while we're downstairs, you can look underneath, and I don't see any oil leaks, puddles. And it's a little, a little bit of a hill, and nothing running off of it. Got all the compartments opened up. Here's your main control valve body. The boom release cylinder going up, I have to adjust it. I'll explain why. It runs real good. Uh, look inside, no oil. Coming around inside the cockpit. I get a better look from the other side when I climb up on it. Compartment here. Steer tires look practically new. The only th leak I found was in this cylinder right here. Stabilizer. Another unique thing that somebody went through a lot of expense and trouble to put that uh, uh, remote lubrication system on. All your steering axle and cylinders come out right next to this outrigger box. Grease fittings right there up and down. Makes it nice. Here's your other outrigger box. Clean and dry. Come around the other side. Pick up the speed, Alan. Pick up the speed. Here's your other cylinder. It's in good shape. The other tire. And coming around quickly through the front. Here's your other cylinder. Here's your turntable. And what I tell you what's wrong with it. Highly unusual. The boom's been up in the air. And look at the base of the boom. There's not a, even a drop of oil on the deck coming out of the base of the boom. The boom lift cylinders, look how dry they are. Nice and dry. The hose real dry. Inside the turntable, dry. Here's your hoses. There is no slip ring on this. I learned that the other day. Coming back around quickly. Here's the heater inside of there. Here's all your gauges, your controls. Pretty good shape. Here's your nasty Detroit diesel down here. Where the hell's a dipstick at? So Here's your oil, where's the hell is it? There's nice and, nice and clean oil, believe it or not. All the glass is good. Looks like somebody replaced the radiator not long ago. And they even had uh, brake proof glass panels at one time. That's why there, there, there's those little clips on it. There's your winch cable going up the boom. It is good and straight. Okay, let me get that off to you.